Hey guys, so today I'm going to show you how to remove the lenses and basically disassemble these Oakley Flak Jacket XLJ sunglasses. Okay, so the first thing we're going to do is we're going to remove the lens from the frame. And so like I mentioned in the review, these glasses are totally customizable. So you can change out the lenses depending on the weather, you know, if it's sunny or kind of overcast, you can change out the lenses whenever you want. So we're going to start with that. So the way you want to do this per Oakley's website is you want to put your finger in between the nose piece. And what you want to do is just grab the lens and you want to bend the frame just a little bit. So what you're going to do is bend the frame just a little bit. There you go. So all you need to do is just bend the frame just a little bit. See how flexible the frame is. So you just need to bend it just a little bit to pop out the frame. Alright, so to put the lens back in, it's pretty much just the opposite. So if you'll see, there's slots on both sides, and I'll show you the pictures. So you can see there's a slot on each side. So of course you want to put the lens back into the slot. And what you want to do is bend it just a little bit. And that way you can get it into the other slot. And then all you need to do from here is just bend the frame just a little bit. And you should be able to pop it in just like that. And the lens is back in. Okay, so the next thing I'm going to show you is how to remove the arm. And so basically you want to remove the arm if you want to be able to take this piece off which is part of the ear sock slash nose piece, nose piece accessory kit. So this piece is part of it. So if you want to take this off, you got to take the arm off. So to do that, just grab the frame. And what you want to do is basically all you do is just twist it off. So you're going to take your right hand and kind of push up. Take your left hand and kind of push down. like that and it pops out. Alright, so to get this piece off, now all you need to do is basically just take your fingers and just slide it right off. So if you keep working at it, it'll come off. And just like that. And it'll come off. I'm not going to take the whole thing off, but basically that's how you do it. Um, when you put it back on, you should probably use a little hand sanitizer or maybe a little bit of soap to get it back on. It makes it a little bit easier to slide it back on. But, you know, you do the same thing. Just use your thumb and your index finger and just slide it back into place. Now, for the ear sock, it's basically the exact same thing, but you go the other way. So, just take your thumb your forefinger and just slide it right off the back. This one's going to take a while because it's pretty long, but it's doable. And then, of course, same thing. You put it back on, slide it back on, use a little bit of soap or some hand, san hand sanitizer and it makes it a lot easier. So same thing, just slide, slide, slide until it goes back into place. Just like that. And for the Oakley symbol, um, you actually can't take it off. The only way you can change it is if you buy the custom Oakleys from their website. And on the website it gives you a choice of a lot of different color Oakley symbols, the middle is actually a different color instead of just being black you can get like blue, yellow, orange, whatever color you want but the only way is to get it through Oakley because it's not you can't actually take it off alright so to put the arm back on it's basically the exact same way you took it off so what you want to do is put the bottom in first and then just pop the top in just like that. So don't be afraid to put a little bit of force into it. You kind of have to to get them get the, uh, the arm back into the slot. But uh, these glasses are pretty durable like I said before so they can handle it. So the last piece I'm going to take off is the nose piece. So uh, you know if you get a different color set then of course you got to change these or they actually come with two different sizes straight from the factory when you buy them. So to take these off, there's two slots, one on each side. 
So what you need to do is pull it, if you look at it like this, pull it down to get it off the first one. Just took it off. You can see it. And then just push up to take it off. So I'll show you a picture so you can see what it looks like in detail. Alright, so the last thing to do is put your nose piece back on. So what I like to do is start from the top and put it over that slot. And then just pull it down over the bottom slot. And then push it back up. And you are good to go.